Hello, my name is Jason DeWart. I'm an SAP Ariba Discovery Supplier Expert. In this video, I'll be covering the basics of editing your profile. Next, it's time to take a look at the three areas of the Edit Profile section that are going to have the biggest impact on finding new business. To navigate to the Edit Profile section, simply hover over Profile and select Edit Profile. So the three areas that I mentioned that are going to have the biggest impact on finding new business are going to be the Basic tab, the Marketing tab, and the Certifications tab. But before we dive into those, I want to point out two items that are going to be pretty important as well. One is the Save and the Close buttons, which can be found at the top right and also the bottom right for your convenience. It's important to use that Save button often. It does save the information on the current tab, meaning that if you input any information on the current tab then switch to a new tab without hitting Save, all the information that you just added will be lost. The other item is the Profile Completeness. As you can see, this account, their profile is only 45% complete. It is not important or necessary to have a profile that is 100% complete, but you can use this area to see some of the items that you're missing. The important ones for this account are going to be the short description, the website, and the company description. Now, both the short description and the website can be found on this basic tab. This short description just allows you to provide a little bit of information about what you can do for your customers. Now, obviously, you want your website on your profile. In case any buyers are taking a look at your profile and are interested in getting more information, they can quickly and easily navigate to your website and find what they need. Scrolling down, you can see that you can input your address. This area is pretty self-explanatory. And then your product and service categories, as well as your ship to and service locations. To make any changes to any either of these areas, just simply use the browse button and select the appropriate categories. Next, we're going to take a look at the marketing tab. This is where you can add your Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn company pages, and also provide a company description. Now, this is going to allow you to add a lot more text using a lot more keywords that allow buyers to find you even faster and more easily. Everything below that section will only be visible on your profile if you choose to go with one of our premium subscriptions. And finally, we're going to take a look at certifications. So this is where you can list if you are a veteran-owned business, minority-owned, woman-owned, if you have any sustainability initiatives, if you have any ISO certifications, and various others as well. Now, a lot of companies prefer to do business with, uh, let's say, an ISO certification if they're looking for somebody with high standards of quality, uh, or if they have any corporate social responsibility initiatives, they may choose to work with either veteran-owned, minority-owned, or woman-owned business. So it's important to list any certifications that apply to you on your profile. Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like more information or assistance with anything else Discovery related, feel free to check out our other videos or contact us at the email below.